out. You must hear this. So this is for us. This is for us who sing, who write, dance, act, study, run and love. And this is for doing it, even if no one will ever know. Because the beauty is in the act of doing it, not what it can lead to. This is for the times I lose myself while writing, singing, playing, and no one is around and they will never know, but I will forever remember. And that shines brighter than any praise or fame or glory I will ever have. And this is for you who write or play or read or sing by yourself with the light off and the door closed when the world is asleep and the stars are aligned and maybe no one will ever hear it or read your words or know your thoughts but it doesn't make it less glorious it makes it ethereal, mysterious, infinite for it belongs to you and whatever God or spirit you believe in and only you can decide how much it meant and means and will forever mean and other people will experience it too through you, through your spirit, through the way you talk, through the way you walk and love and laugh and care. And I never meant to write this long, but what I want to say is, don't try to pretend your art by making other people read or hear or see or touch it. Make them feel it. Wear your art like your heart on your sleeve and keep it alive by making people feel a little bit better, feel a little lighter, create, create art in order for yourself to become yourself and let your very existence be your song, your poem, your story. Let your very identity be your book. Let the way people say your name sound like the sweetest melody. So go, create, take photographs in the woods, Run alone in the rain, sing your heart out high up on a mountain where no one will ever hear and your very existence will be the most hypnotizing scar. Make your life be your art and you will never be forgotten. Yes.